Hey, what's going on, everybody? Uh, I messed up. Um, I moved my mic on episode 17, and I messed up. Okay, holy shit, there's a cat just jumped on my desk. No, get down, cat. Please leave. I don't want to pet. Actually, you know what? I'll pet the cat, because I'm not playing the game. Alright, so, as you can tell, obviously, this is not a live gameplay commentary. This is not uh, a normal episode, and neither will be uh, number 18, I believe. Um, I moved my microphone, and I, uh, the light was still on, like it was still getting power, but it stopped recording. So I guess I'm just going to do like a commentary over this one. I have it playing in like almost two times speed uh, because I wanted to, I didn't want this to be super long. I didn't really, I wanted you guys to see the gameplay like this is exactly what I experienced. Uh, I cut out, I went to the, uh, the little diner shop and sold some stuff and I kind of looked around that little building I guess uh, where the settlers were or that new settlement I think it's Oberlin is what it was and here we end up going to the I think it's the back street apparel and it's right in the city well not not the city but a city I guess and it was for the most part it was a long episode because I went to the town or no I, I didn't go to the town I I sorted through a lot of menus early on in this and I also traveled on foot and I tried to sneak through this town uh, I also I just looked around a lot and it all around it wasn't a very exciting episode the backstreet apparel wasn't very exciting at all uh, you'll be able to tell at the end I'm trying to slow down this is why I sped it up because Altogether, the episode was like 27 minutes, I think. So, I, I didn't know what I was going to talk about for 27 minutes, already knowing what happens. And, like, I hope you guys can't hear the phone. I'm going to be really sad if that's the case. But, I'm not going to answer for the simple fact that it's usually a telemarketer not a huge fan of telemarketers I'm just gonna wait until it's done okay but yeah I found this little settlement thing it looks like it looks like a pretty nifty spot yeah it caught on fire instantly and died which I thought was kinda bull but whatevs so basically I'm just gonna sit here and talk to you guys um, let the gameplay play in the background. That's I, I don't. I feel like this is like disconnected. This was one of my more. Uh, I feel like my banter, like my random, just talking about things in the game, is getting like a lot better. And I think in these two episodes, like it was just, it was pretty good. And the next episode, you guys will see. Uh, I actually, well, in this video, I was going to spoil it for you. I wasn't going to spoil it. I was just going to say, at the end of this video, I say that we're going to go to Vault 81. And we end up doing that next episode. So next episode will also be a commentary about Vault 81. And whether I think it's worth it to go there. Um, so we'll we'll discuss that. Uh, next episode because I think there's a lot more that goes into getting into vault 81 than most people think and charisma has a lot to do with it charisma I feel like is more important in this game than it has been in a lot of other games I feel like that there are so many conversational pieces in this game that require like good charisma even early on in the game that get you ahead and I feel like that's important and I'm sure that's gonna be even more prevalent with the the more factions that you that you see and holy shit cat jumped up again uh, and the more people that you know and get to talk to I would say that 
with that being the case, the charisma is going to play a huge part. And I don't remember what I originally had for the trivia question. Yeah, here's a random merchant. I thought this was kind of cool. She doesn't really sell anything specific, but I thought it was just cool that, like, she was just randomly here. Um, I don't know. I thought it was kind of... I thought it was cool, so... What what ifs? I don't. This game is so compact, and I wanted to in this episode. Had I not taken forever already, I would be going like building to building, like I have been doing. And we will go back to that style of play. But I feel like the the quest structure is starting to stretch out more. So the things that you're doing take a little bit more time to get to. They take a little bit more time to. Uh, materialize and like fully flesh themselves out as to what you're supposed to do who you're killing that kind of thing but I didn't even realize that splashing glitch right there that's kind of funny but yeah I'm not I don't know I don't know it feels really awkward just sitting here like talking to you guys but not playing I should have made this I feel like it looks like super fast right now and I don't want it to I, I hope that it doesn't really affect you guys that much in a sense that like it kind of depersonalizes the video because I feel like that's the case when, when I watch someone doing this and I can obviously tell that it was recorded afterwards I don't feel as into the video specifically because you you don't feel like you're actually in the moment you you're talking to somebody or with somebody that already it's kind of like yeah, that has already experienced the moment so it's kind of like watching a movie with someone that's already seen it now for me I actually like being the per well this is gonna be your trivia so pay attention to this so for me I like watching movies with people who have yet to watch the movie because I can see their like first time reactions and that I think that's really like I don't know why I think that's cool if this cat unplugs my microphone I'm gonna fucking beat the shit out of it anyways don't mind my banter um, but for me I like what I like being that person who knows what's gonna happen and then like gets to see like oh that was awesome or oh that's cool or oh that's crazy you know just kinda like seeing the reaction of people I also like being the person that uh, watches movies with other people who have yet to see the movie I think that that is I hope you can't hear that dog barking there's so many distractions right now I need to because when I record with a game I shut my door, have everything turned off, like I'm fully focused, but right now there's dogs barking, there's cats climbing all over my keyboard, it's it's distracting, but uh, I absolutely hate going to the movies with people who have already seen the movie, and they are like expecting me to like, you know, like, you can just tell when something's about to cool, something cool is about to happen because like you can just see like them they're like tensing up or like they're like looking over at you and looking for your reaction I don't like that 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 just completely takes me out of the movie for some reason I love watching movies and I love like the video games in a sense where I can get completely lost in them and I don't I don't have any other cares in the world now if I'm thinking about somebody else like looking at me or some shit I just turns me off I don't I don't know exactly it's maybe I'm weird I don't know so your trivia question is um, how do I like to watch movies or play video games and it is either by myself or with people who have yet to play them um, so yeah uh, also some information on the uh, the giveaway uh, I was actually paid a day later than normal so that kind of put a hitch on things because it was Tuesday and I was like okay I'm getting paid um, I'm gonna be good for the giveaway 
I'm going to contact the person. I'll be able to get it to them. Well, we got paid a day later than normal because of some bank issue, which is fine by me. But, like, I don't like saying stuff and then it being incorrect or whatever. So, uh, yeah, that kind of set me back a day. And I've been recording stuff a day in advance. So, like... Wednesday or Tuesday's video was recorded on like Monday or, or maybe even Sunday. So it's just, I'm just kind of backed up. Uh, I'm going to contact the today should be, fuck, what is today? Today should be th that you're seeing this should be Friday. I know I'm still behind, but on Friday, I will contact the person and then by Sunday, I will announce the winner if they have contacted me back. If not, I will pick somebody else. I do, I'm not going to do like this publicly because I don't I don't like that. I'm going to contact them via message. If they message me back, get back to them. If not, then we will pick somebody else. But we will be giving it away. Don't worry. You guys aren't getting hosed. I really appreciate you guys commenting and staying with me. Um, this is the end of this episode. We'll talk more about that on uh, 18 and then... Uh, Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully everything goes smoothly with the giveaway. So, all right. Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.